Okay, so this book is called Before the Wax Melts. But um, what does that mean? What is the context of the title for this book? In all, this book took me about seven years to write. It nearly took another seven years to work out the title. We threw around title after title and idea after idea with the book committee that helped me write it. And nothing really grabbed me until rather like inspiration from heaven, uh, this title came to me. It's a metaphor. Life is about finding the middle path. Life is about ignoring the two extremes and trying to find your way down the center. And the story is from a Greek myth, uh, Daedalus and Icarus, who were imprisoned on an island. There's no ways they could get off. So Daedalus, who was an engineer, uh, designed for his son Icarus and himself a pair of wings each. He made it of feathers, he tied the feathers together and then sealed them with wax. And then like all good fathers, he said to his son, now my boy, be careful. If you go too low while flying, the humidity of the sea is gonna pull you down, wet your wings, and you're gonna not be able to fly further. If you fly too high, the sun is gonna melt your wax and you're gonna do, and the heat will cause you to uh, crash down as well. And the boy, like all boys, said, yes, dad, and don't tell me what to do, was what he was thinking. Uh, I understand, put on the wings and did exactly what his dad did, uh, suggested. But then, uh, of course, the testosterone took over and he said, this is easy. I know how to ride my bicycle, if it was a 21st century boy, uh, or my motorbike, if it's a 21st century young man, or wings, if it's Icarus. And he said, watch me, Dad. And he went down and he soared upwards and he found it was quite easy. Then he soared further upwards and then disaster happened. The sun melted the wings, he crashed down to his death. So I say that this book is about understanding boys, uh, giving them advice, but at the same time, uh, putting boundaries in place because otherwise our boys won't survive till they're 21. So we've got to catch our boys before the wax melts. If we're going to keep them alive and have them as young men, you're going to make a, a role in society.